Hey guys, it's your boy Organ HDI, and welcome back to Pixelmon and our single player adventure. I uh, hope you guys are having a good day. Welcome back to today's episode. Um, got a couple of comments. We got one comment on the wall. Uh, so, um, thanks for you guys' comments in the last episode. Thanks for all the support. You guys are shown on the series as per usual. And remember, if you are liking the video or the series, don't forget to smack that like button. Um, it's just amazing to see your support on this series and if you like in the series to also subscribe as well to never miss a Pixelmon video. So the comment today it was a bit random like one person had a nickname suggestion for uh, uh, Swinup and then like a couple of other people who were like oh yeah I want to, I want to name Swinup as well. Like, it was a bit random I don't think we caught him last episode did we? We caught him a while ago. Um, so Swinup He's the star of the show today, he gets a nickname, look at him, <laughs> random bit of swat up. And who was the person that chose his nickname? It was the, there he is, um, Joel Tank, it was Joel Tank, who said cool swine up peanut. So I like that little, little, ooh, e, uh, uh, rename, peanut, I like that little name, nice and cute. So swine up is now peanut, does he know ancient power? Um, no he doesn't, so I don't think he can evolve into Mamoswine. Uh, but that's alright, we'll just have to catch about a million of them and hope that we get the right one. But let's get Stan back, Stan the man. Uh, and today, I had a bit of a craving to do something different. I had a little bit of a craving like, um, earlier today. I felt like really, really, really um, wanting to finish my house because it's a, it's a bit of poop at the moment. And I really want to move into there. Um, so there's a mad craving to finish it off. So that's what I want to do today. A bit of work on the house, maybe a bit of work on the on the mart. Although that's um, that needs to be done in creative mode because well, it's all made of quartz and it's a bit hard to get quartz. So and you guys let me do that. So uh, what do I need? I'll just grab everything I think. Birch slabs. Why not, mate? Why not? And we'll pop over to the house. I might need to get some more wood because we are running a little bit low. But luckily. We are near a forest and tiger biome, so we're good to go. But what I wanted to do is kind of... I really want to make a basement somewhere. I really want to make a basement. But what I've done is just really stuffed up the the setting up of my house. So I've got like a kitchen. I've got a computer lab. I should really move the computer lab downstairs. Actually, I could do... Oh, but then I have to move the healer. Oh, it's just too hard. It is just too hard. I could have it outstairs. Outstairs. Outside, maybe. Um, downwards. I could, or I could extend this out a bit. Ooh, too many choices. Or I could have it just done here. Actually, let's see if this works. Um, oh gosh, we're running outside now. But maybe just like here, and then go down one, down another one, and then down three, and oh, cool, oh my god. Uh, would this be deep enough to rock, rock on? I think it might be. So we could have a a bit of a uh, sick little basement up in here. That could be pretty cool for storage. I might just move all my chests. How far can we go across? There we go. There's the limit. It's lucky that we have this amazing silk touch pick um spade to get those grass blocks back. Because what would I have done without them? Don't know. And another thing we need to do is start making the fossil. This spade is actually really slow. I thought it'd be good. It's also the silk touch one. I want to test out my other one that I had. Um, so much dirt. Oh my god. Oh my god. And it's about to go in night time. So I could have a bit of a snooze. I'll do a bit of training as well. Because Pablo's about to level up. Uh, I mean evolve. So I really want to get him evolved as well. And what was I getting? What was I getting? Oh yeah, my spade. <laughs> Lucky I went into the right chest. I want to see how quick it goes. I want to see if it's like just blitzes through. Or if it's pretty trashy. You know, just want to test it out. But I'll battle a few Arbucks right now, I think. I wouldn't mind getting an old Pablo evolved, that would be nice. Uh, 45 for buddy. Yes, please, we'll go to Sparkles. And I need to chuck Riri out, I forgot again! Oh no, I forgot again! Um, <laughs> it always happens to me, doesn't it? Bam, nice. Good stuff, Pablo, got a level. Uh, there's a lot of these things. So Riri, you can go out. What is he at the moment? Oh, he's pretty close. He's 184 at the moment. And I'm pretty sure it needs to get to something like 220. And then what we need to do is level him up in the day. So, uh, 
yeah, we could possibly do that today if we just build and, and chuck him out. Actually, that's pretty. That's a pretty good idea. Is it a boss? No, he's pretty big. He's an absolute monster. Look at him. Is it not that high of a level? Let's see if I can kill him. Oh, Pablo's actually pretty strong. Oh my god, he's pretty strong. Although he's a lot higher level. Uh, hello, Zorak. Hello, Zorak. We'll swap out the sparkles for this one. Um, but that's a good idea, building and getting happiness on Riri. I'll just have to run in, but I always chuck him out. And he might get in the way, but boom! There we go, he is evolving. That's good to see. Good to see, mate. And he's gonna be a, a big, big Pablo. He's gonna be a big Pablo now. Um, I, I like the look of them. I can't actually remember what he- No, he's... Wait, what does he look like? Boom, yeah, wait. Has he changed? He's changed, man, he's changed. Uh, no, he looks the same, I think. But I, I love the look at him. Uh, he looks mad. He looks sick. He can't ride him. What is this madness? Oh, we're out. Uh, so all that sleep. Now we've done our night training. Now we sleep during... Uh, we'll sleep now. Boom! There we go. <laughs> Jump shot into the bed. I was like, wow! And then dived into bed. Um, there we go. Hello. Riri, what are you doing outside? Um, so, the basement. Let's see how the... There it is. How we just blitzes through. Oh my god! Riri, you teleported. Um, oh! Yes, yeah, that's pretty quick. <laughs> that's pretty quick. I will... Uh, I'll take the spade. I'm a fan of it. Where is Edge, though? I think this might be the Edge up here. Damn, it's actually really, really quick. I, I would like to test it out on... A bit of... A bit of... A bit of... A bit of... Bit of gravel. See if how it quick is it uh, how quick it is through the gravel. And fill that there. Fill that there. And boom. Uh, but this is a good size for a bit of a basement. We could clear out this edge here as well if I wanted. But yeah, I might just do that. Give us a extra little bit. I could put chum chum just there. Ba bam. Ba bam and my pickaxe. Could tear through that, not quite as quick. <laughs> oh, I was lucky that a lot of that was dirt. And boom, there we go. This looks quite cool. Looks quite cool. I need some torches though. Here's my torches. Oh, I need to make some pokeballs as well. Okay, there we go. Uh, and we'll chuck these here. Why not? Why not, eh, mate? Why not? And what are we going to do here? We'll do that for now, but it's probably going to look terrible from outside. <laughs> um, so the basement's done. We should probably move the computers downstairs. Yeah, let's do that, but we'll have to keep the healer up, because when you break a healer, uh, you don't get the healer back, you only get the, like, a one aluminium plate, which is a bit, it's, it's a bit sucky, so we'll put the LAN system up here, <laughs> oh my god, the quad, the quad monitors, uh, I still, uh, wait, I know, I know where my other one is, it's at the beach centre, I think it's just chilling outside, oh gosh, lagtastic, uh, it's right there, there's one right there, yeah, here it is, cheeky. I forgot about that one. Um, anything, anything happening? I might come back here when it's night time. Have a bit of a hunt around for Kyogre. We're still trying to find the Kyogre. We've not found it yet. I'm probably gonna flip out when I find that bad boy. Um, but let's get back into. Oh, Pablo's evolved, so I might just chuck him away. Uh, he can go there. And who should we get out? Uh, boom. And Magma's Court. Who should we level up next? Polywag. He's up next. <laughs> Polywag's on the list next. I think you can get quite a few from him. But like there's... Can you get Politoed yet? Is Politoed in Pixamon? I don't know. I don't even know if he is. Uh, but the main thing I wanted to do was the roof. So let's see if I can get that achieved today. If I can, uh, mission accomplished. And we need a crafting table. Here we go. I'll just turn this all into bam de thing, and I want to make some uh, stairs. That's going to make a poot on forty. That'll be good. That'll be good because I want to make like a bit of a brim. <laughs> so I don't, I don't really know how I'm going to do this, but I might just wing it and see how it goes. So, hey, uh, let's see how this looks out. Put like a brim. Oh gosh, I can't even. I can't even put it down. Why? Why can't I not put it down? I'll use dirt actually as the uh, scaffolding. Dirt, dirt, dirt. There we go. Get out of the dirt. And 
plonk these down. There we go. Oh gosh! <laughs> Damn it, I need to make a staircase up. I need to make a staircase. Like so. Hey! There we go. That's upside down. That's good. I'll put that there. And there. And then why is that not there? Oh, did we not sort that out? I don't think we did. There we go. How does that look? Well, it's hard to tell because it's all filled up by dirt. Uh, let's clear it out then. Clear out the scaffolding and this bit of junk. Let's see if I want to carry this on through the house. Oh, that actually looks kind of disgusting. <laughs> that kind of looks pretty disgusting. I need your guys' help, really, on these builds because I'm a pretty bad builder. And I'm definitely terrible as at roofs. Actually, what I might just do is have like an upstairs um, and just have like a bit of a penthouse rock a bit of a penthouse or something like that because roofs are just not my thing like I cannot for the life of me build roofs I don't know why that is I could build like a bit of a staircase up here actually I want to do stairs here um, not upside down please please thank you and I'll get rid of this so it looks beautiful. I need it to look beautiful. Oh my god, it's so quick. The spade is OP. It just tears everything apart in the blink of an eye. There we go. And uh, a bit of oak, I think it was. Dosh, 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 dosh. Dosh, dosh. There we go. That looks a little bit disgusting as well, but I'm just going to roll with it. Got the computer set up there. <laughs> the computer set up. Oh my gosh, it's amazing. I need to have like a... Uh, oh gosh. Maybe something like that. That kind of looks kind of... That kind of looks kind of bad. Maybe the stairs. What the stairs look like. Um, ooh. That looks pretty cool. Oh, that looks rad. That actually looks pretty sick. Not gonna lie, I am pretty pleased with that. This is the computer setup. We could have um, some chairs. <laughs> there we go. Some chairs set up here. It's a little bit close. Um, oh, no, 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 no. I know what I should do. I... My... Uh, what axe is about to break? Oh well. I might... Now I'm going to go into creative mode for a second. I'm not going to spawn any master balls in, but there is some furniture. Yes! Chairs. I'll chuck a chair down. I want to see what this looks like. I want to pimp my house out. I don't know if there's a way to actually um, legit make those. Oh my god! That actually looks so sick. I need to get like some people around. <laughs> Have like a... God, that is actually pretty cool. I should chuck some more stuff around in my house. What other cool stuff is there? Um, a table. Oh, let's chuck a table up here. I might chuck one of these. We could have like a, a bit of a dining table like here. Oh, like that. Oh, it connects up as well. That's actually really sick. I am not gonna lie. What about a wheelchair? That's pretty cool. Oh, what do you guys think of that? Um, let me know what you guys think about me spawning in these sort of furniture things. So it's not it's not really cheating. It's just sort of aesthetic stuff. Uh, if you don't want me to spawn it all in, like I understand, I, I won't do it again. <laughs> I swear I won't do it again. Um, I just wanted to test it out. So let's get out of cheaty mode. Cheaty mode. Um, but the roof. Mm. Uh, yeah, I was gonna build something upstairs, wasn't I? I don't know how confident I feel and there we go and there we go. oh gosh stuffed up I don't know how confident oh gosh god damn it yeah there we go I don't know how confident I feel and in, in building it upstairs I might work on something uh, uh, oh that's way too low I need to go up like one or two more damn it I'll work on that uh, in between episodes I'll come up with like a little idea and maybe work on it next episode, but let's try and get polybag a few levels. Um, <clears throat> what wall is that a boss? I think that might be a yellow boss. Hey, yellow boss posse! Whoop whoop! Nice way to reward me for uh, my fail building. Uh, ba boom, there we go, 93. Wow, actually my Pokemon is so poo to take this uh, pulse on. I'm gonna have to like cross my fingers that it doesn't have an electric move. Because charge, okay, that didn't do anything. Power gem. Oh, he's, okay, he's paralyzed. Because uh, my high level Pokemon are Flutters, Sparkles, and Roska, and all of them are, well, 
are either going to get demolished by electric attacks or do nothing to him. Let's try this move. Oh, yeah, does nothing. <laughs> um, so that's fun. This is going to probably take about 100 years to do, but it looks like... Whoa! Damn, he's got thunder and just one shot the poop out of me there. Um, I think Riri might have just came back. And my moves are terrible. Oh, my moves are terrible. Mega Horn. What's Mega Horn? Oh, Mega Horn is alright. Mega Horn, yeah, buddy! It is heaps. Oh, boy, oh, boy. We got 444. We got 4,444 XP on Roska. It's. That's pretty spiritual. Um, <laughs> a lot of XP on, on my bat, on my boy Polywag. Uh, let's get rid of Bubble. And oh, this is all actually pretty interesting loot. Moonstone, Ultra Ball, Sunstone, Protector. Protector, we needed that one. And an Orb. Um, hey, and he's evolving. We didn't really need any of that apart from the Protector, I think. So kind of trash from a Yellow Boss, but you know. I'll accept it. Yellow boss is yellow boss, and it's a lot of XP as well, so I'm pretty happy with that turnout. Um, it's been a few episodes since our last yellow boss, so it was a nice little cheeky spot in there. And we've got Polly Whirl. He wants to learn Bubble Beam again, which he won't. Um, oh, wow. That actually looks pretty cool. I want to see what this looks like in shaders. What does it look like in shaders? Does it look like real majestic as? Oh my god, look at it! You can't even see anything! <laughs> Oh, I just absolutely love shaders. I don't know about you guys. It probably doesn't look that great in video But I love shaders. I love it. Only problem is it's a bit laggy and That's probably that's a very big downside um, but poly Whirl is The only poly wrath and does he evolve water stone? I think he does I might actually Because I know there's a uh, poly and I think he's a uh, he evolves with a I've shot this all the way for today. Uh, I think he evolves with a, a moon. King's Rock. Um, but it gets rid of all this junk as well. Um, don't know what I'm saying. Don't know what I'm saying. What am I saying? Help me out here, guys. Don't know. Anyway. Uh, bam, bam, bam. And that's all Moonstone. We got, <laughs> we got six Moonstones now. Can you believe that? Because I'm struggling to, to fathom that. But my, yeah, Waterstone, I was going to evolve my boy, Poliwoo. I'm actually a fan of Poliwrath. He looks so sick. I remember when they changed this model. Like, this was the first model they made into the sort of 3D, uh, not, um, sort of like curved body. This was like the first model, I'm pretty sure. Like, one of the first anyway. And it was just like jaw dropping when it happened. Like, it was game changing. And now pretty much everything is like this. Like, look at that. Oh, he looks just so red. And I remember his like, arms would stuff up, like, it just like glitch out of his body. Oh! Oh! You can ride him! I did not know that. What does he look like? Oh, he looks so sick! Look at him! He kind of, like, he kind of reminds me of, like, um, Mario, or probably more Wario. Like, just, just, just the king of the, king of the city. Oh my god, look at him. He actually looks really cool. <laughs> His arms and legs are just bolting it, but his body is just not moving at all. He looks so funny. Oh, I love him. I love you, boy. Polyrath. We might need some nicknames for him, because I might actually use him. I don't know if he learns any moves. Oh, that's a, probably like the worst nature for him. Um, oh, well. He, he's cool. He looks sick, and he can ride him. What more do you want? What more do you want? So we'll chuck him away for now, but we'll probably use him later, because he's oh, sick. And we could start on something else. Oddish. He's an easy one. The red reddish, <laughs> the red reddish. I might see if I can get him evolved today. That would be pretty. That would be pretty rad. That would be a very rad, actually. I just need to quickly heal up the Pokemon though, because I noticed. Oh, I actually love that. Although it's kind of right in the middle of everything, so I might have to shift it. We could shift it along here, maybe. Can I break it? And will it give me it? No, you can't break it. <laughs> Okay, it's invincible. So maybe that's maybe you can't actually naturally craft that stuff uh, If you can't break it, but I need, need to sort this out too. I think it was just gonna be glass wasn't it? I might just have is there any glass? I think it's glass. Yeah, there is 16 glass planes. I might just chuck it up in here 
uh, and that will connect it to the next floor, which I think I'll make one more because it seemed too low there, um, or one or two more. And then I can have like a pool and heaps of stuff up there. Oh, a pool! Oh yeah. Uh, let's sort that out. Um, two spades. I need to make a, a diamond wooden axe, I think. A diamond wood axe, whatever they're called. Uh, diamond axe, I think it's just called. Uh, let's have a quick go in the in the, in the, in the oh, a lot of spawns, a lot of spawns and spawns in the extreme hill. See if we can find any high level Pokemon or um, things. You know the ones not they are Snorlax here. Okay, we'll take, build battle them. Um, what are they called? What are they called? Sableyes, diamonds. We want some diamonds. So if we can find any of those, I will be a happy chappy. I'll be the happiest chop in all of England. Um, what's that from? I think so. I remember saying someone saying that back in back in the day, back at school. Oh my god, I can't even take this guy. Oh my, uh, Mega Horn's a really good move, but everything else is doing trash. Everything else is doing trash. There we go. Uh, the Rad Radish is getting some radical XP, man. Getting some radical XP, y'all. Oh, get rid of that. He's going to learn all the other ones, isn't he? <laughs> um, sleep powder. Yeah, we'll get rid of stun spore. Uh, and he didn't evolve. What? What? <laughs> he didn't evolve, Graveler. Okay, uh, we'll swap out to Oscar boy. Please don't kill me. Where's the shell? There we go. And I heard a bit of a ding sound. What does that mean? We're level 15. We level up so quick, like uh, Minecraft levels, I mean. Um, you get the XP so quick, because I think it was like last episode, wasn't it? That I got an enchantment. Oh, do I want to use? Do I want to use? Do I have what are you? I. Why is that reset again? Oh no, I didn't. Okay, but I'm 99% sure I've caught one of you, so I'll just tick you off there. Um, Pulsey. Oh, there's another one there. Oh, that's cute! That is cute! I know what to catch you. I want to catch you. I want to catch you. Is that a grotto right here? Ooh, have you been to it? We haven't. What? This is right by our house, so we haven't been to it. Um, what? We got HM waterfall. Ooh, that's pretty cool. Um, HMs like didn't know you could actually get them from that. And you can use that unlimited times. So, um. Waterfall, yeah, it's a pretty decent move. Oh, here you are, mate. You try to run away, you cheeky. Cheeky, cheeky, there we got him. Uh, let's put him to sleep. Although he's probably going to wake up in a few turns. Damn it, it missed. Um, actually, I'm going to keep Rad Radish out. We'll just have to do a few tackles on him. Or uh, acid moves on him. Oh, God. He's low now. He's low. He killed me. Why well, have you got a stand and hypnosis that? Had no effect. Oh, it has no effect. Damn it, okay, let's just try a Pokeball. A Pokeball. Let's try a Pokeball. Maybe we haven't caught it because it's not showing there. It's not showing there that we've caught it. So, hey, we've caught it now. And I think that might have been a Pygmy. That's pretty rad. <laughs> it's pretty rad. That's the word of the day. Rad. You guys got to use that a few times today. If possible, just chuck that into your sentences. Um, you yeah, man, it's rad as. It's radical as, boo. Uh, but I might end it off, I might end this rad episode off for today guys. If you liked the episode, don't forget to smack that like button and comment down below. I love seeing all you guys' support and I'll, I'll try to reply to as many comments as possible. Uh, and yeah guys, I'll see you next episode and peace.